Hey guys, I'm back here again. Now I'm on the other side of the weight room. Um, I'm at the, the free weights, we'll call them. So what I'm gonna demonstrate now is the bench press, um, bench press and curls. So there is one, two, three, four, five. There's five different racks in the middle here. Um, so there's multiple opportunities to get your benching and your squatting in. So bench press is obviously upper body and squat is lower body as well. So you got your bench for bench press and this bar right here that I'm going to do is it's a 45 pound bar. And then obviously we have the different weights that we can put on there. Um, but there's rivets on this bar and then there's a smooth part and more rivets. But what I like to do is here, I'll show you guys. Um, I will place my um, pinkies on the smooth part right there. So then that kind of just shows me that my hands are even on the bar. So I'm going to demonstrate the bench press for you guys. So again, you want to get comfortable on the bench. Feet, feet at a good angle in the spot. You want to come down, lay down on that bench. Line your hands up. I'm actually going to put my feet up. And then pinkies on that smooth part, looking straight up, concentrating on that weight. And you're going to push off. And then you're going to go down. Probably about, you know, not quite down to your chest, but almost. So, going down with the bar, going fully up. Make sure you're breathing. So, when you're going, when you push up, you breathe out. When you go down, breathe in. And then you want to just do. Three sets of 10 usually, just like any other of the workouts. And you wanna keep your arms level and even, cause you don't wanna sit there and do this and have, you know, lose your weights. And there's also clamps that you can put on the ends of the, of the barbells to stop the weights from falling off as well. And you should have you should always have a spotter with you when you're, you're lifting, um, when you're bench pressing or squatting or anything like that um, to help you if the bar would happen to slip out of your hands or you can't get that weight up. So uh, bear with me for a few seconds. If I'd be able to um, just do this really quick. I'm gonna do a squat for you guys. I'll just bring the bar over here and then I'll bring the camera over with me when I get set up. So I'll be right back really quick. Sorry guys, thought I was gonna be prepared. All 
All right, so here is the squat rack right here. And then I'm gonna put you guys back over this way. So then it'll be at the, at the side angle. So again, I'm gonna back you up. Again with the uh, with the bar, the barbell. Um, pinkies, my pinkies are gonna line up with that smooth part on the bar. And there is, there's two bigger smooth parts on the bar as well. And then there's more rivets in the middle. My neck is gonna rest, the bar is gonna rest with the rivets on my neck. So you load up the weights and then you're going underneath with the bar at a little squat at a you know squat here and you come back a little bit feet shoulder width apart and you're going down okay you're going down at an angle knees bending I'm gonna widen my stance a little bit more. <laughs> Looking straight ahead the whole time. And going down and up. Make sure you're breathing. And you're staying level that whole time. Okay? So there is your squats and your bench press. Um, if you guys need me to demonstrate when we're in person, I will gladly help you guys out with that. So I'm going to sign off here from the Chan Hassan weight room and uh, can't wait to get over here with you guys and do these exercises. So. Always remember, be kind. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.